Tonight, dozens of shelter dogs and cats are now here in Cincinnati after a long drive from Houston. One nonprofit brought the shelter animals to the Tri-State to help other pets who are impacted by Hurricane Harvey. Nine on your side's Ashley Zilka was there for their arrival. Princess Jasmine just arrived from Texas. Volunteers from Louis Legacy are bringing back more than 100 animals right here to Cincinnati. They will be placed into foster homes until they are adopted permanently. After more than 20 hours on the road, two vans full of animals arrived in Cincinnati. There's more on the way. Volunteers from Louis Legacy tell me they had one goal in mind when they decided to go to Houston. If I can even make one family reunite with their dogs about a family that make, feels the same as I do about my dogs, it's worth it. In order to do that, Louie's legacy cleared out shelters in Texas to make room for animals that got lost in the hurricane. We learned a lot from Katrina in the rescue world and um, decided that we wanted to keep those animals directly affected by the hurricane close to home so they can be reunited with their families. Back at home, volunteers carefully paired up the shelter dogs with local foster families who wanted to help. They screened, they prepped, they coordinated, they found out who was going to have who. We've been talking about it for a while and so we figured what better time to do it than now to help out the Hurricane Harvey dogs. If you are interested in becoming a foster family like some of these people, Louie's Legacy always needs help. You can go online for more information. They are actually already planning another rescue trip while they wait to see what exactly happens with Hurricane Irma. Reporting in Monfort Heights, Ashley Zilka, Night on Your Side.